Welcome to Epic Stock Due Diligence. Please subscribe at youtube.com forward slash epic stock DD. Thank you. Hey y'all, Ed here back again with another exciting Epic Stock DD video. Now today I want to talk about bottom fishing for triple zero one plays. Now if you're not familiar with triple zero one, dot zero 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 one is the lowest price that a stock can be listed at. So uh, most of those stocks seldom ignite, but if they do, the people that we're in before the uh, price per share starts to increase can likely make a killing. Now, if you're bottom fishing, it's one of the riskiest things you can do. Uh, if you've seen my other video, definitely, uh, if you find a triple zero one, see how horrible the share structure is, because it may be so horrible it's not even worth speculating. But if it's got somewhat decent share structure for a triple zero one, what I would suggest next is looking at the level two during the trading day and see how many blocks of shares are on the ask at triple zero one. Ultimately, there's going to be no bid. So when you look at bid, there won't be any market makers. But look at the ask. Are we talking hundreds of millions or maybe just 10 or 20 million or maybe just a few million? The ones that just have a few million are the ones that could potentially ignite uh, with even expected news or whatever other type of pump. So uh, not to say that market makers can't hide the shares that they have, but that's that's something to check out. Again, expect to lose every penny, but this is just another tip that I wanted to share with my fans. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash Epic Stock DD and encourage your friends to join and check out my book on iTunes, The Penny Stock Perfectionist. Y'all have a great day.